it's when paedophiles have kids that they really come into their own. <laughs> Hello, what's the crack? What's the story? Welcome, welcome back to the channel. As you can see, I'm joined with the lovely, the handsome, <laughs> the lovely. perfect, the great, the sexy Tyler. Relax, relax, relax. Let's <laughs> go to slow leaving the fucking studio. <laughs> I'm joined by guy, man. Today we're reacting to some Gary Delaney Ruthless One Liners. I've checked this already and I absolutely loved it. So I'm gonna be showing it to you. So this guy just does one liners. Oh, okay. So literally back to back, back to back, but he does dirty. Dark, dark humor one liners. Right. And I know you like dark humor. Right, and we both like dark humor. You're gonna love it. Let's go. Sometimes uh, people get in touch with me to complain about my jokes if they think something offense offensive. They get in touch on Twitter, on Facebook, or email me through my website or something. Uh, and uh, I, when they do that, I make a little note of it because I know that means that's a good joke and I should probably do it more. <laughs> so, what I've done, this is a collection of my most complained about jokes ever. <laughs> So that's what we're going to fucking do. And so look, if you're watching that on the little video, if you complain about these after that warning, that means you're a fucking retard, okay? Here we go. I fisted ventriloquist once to see how he liked it. My cousin was a heroin addict by the age of 13. It's amazing, isn't it? Kids shoot up so fast these days. <laughs> Personally, I prefer morning sex, as it's when people are recently bereaved or at the most vulnerable. <laughs> That's good. The ooze have started and we're only on joke three. <laughs> The other day, my girlfriend and I had great makeup sex. Well, I say that, she was out and I stuck her lipstick up my ass. <laughs> because I'm worth it. <laughs> a gay friend of mine recently had his arm in a cast. It was the cast of Joseph and his amazing technical dream. <laughs> See? We're plunging downhill already. Islamic State have released their own range of anti-dandruff shampoo. It's called Shoulders. <laughs> the Make-A-Wish Foundation should really be called the No Make Another Wish Foundation. So you said they were rough. No one's first wish is for Disneyland, is it? Doctor, doctor, I'm addicted to fucking dogs. Have you tried patches? What's here, poodle? <laughs> I once met a woman whose pelvic muscles were so strong, she said no man would ever dare to finger her. So I offered to help, and she snatched my hand off. <laughs> I pulled a sickie the other day, just one of the perks of working at the hospital. <laughs> Not like... <laughs> <laughs> and you know his wife as well his wife is probably one of the most funniest UK uh, comedians uh, Sarah Millican she's so so funny as well oh, I think yeah I think have you heard yeah, of heard yeah, Sarah yeah, Millican yeah, she's yeah. so so funny I'm coming to introduce you to Sarah Millican as well let's get back we're actually loving this isn't it loving it I've seen this already but it's still so fresh to me let's go <laughs> About half of you are unshockable and half of you are. That's good, but we're going to keep on pushing. We can, I'll see if I can offend the fucking all of you before I finish. I think the worst thing about having sex with your mom would be if you lost your erection, she'd just say, well, where did you last have it? <laughs> it's when paedophiles have kids that they really come into their own. <laughs> what? If you clap that, you're a dreadful fucking person. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Are we all okay? I'm quite a sensitive man. I don't mind being held after sex. It's only when they press charges it gets tricky. I mean, that seems quite mild after the last one, that one. 
Werther's originals are so horrible, you'd gladly suck your granddad's cock just to get the taste out of your mouth. <laughs> oh, God, we're getting worse. OK. As a family, we couldn't decide whether to have Nana buried or cremated, so in the end, we let her live. I don't like emo kids, all pale and ill-looking and talking about death all the time, you know. Sorry, chemo kids. I want to let go of your zone. What the like, fuck? Oh. Nah. I'm evil. Like, nah. Oh, like, I'm like, did you see that? Like, see? Oh. But you know, I don't get people that, you know, that report this kind of stuff. If you don't like it, just don't watch it. You know, mm-hmm. comment. It's not real. Isn't it? But I think it's just people that maybe they know someone as a chemo patient or, you yeah. know, you'll get to them. You know what but I mean? But would you, do you think if you, would you go to a show if you know someone? If I knew it's going to be crude like this, mm-hmm. obviously not. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Why well, I put myself Exactly. In yeah. Just like, leave. Yeah. In it, just leave it. Why bother complaining when other people are? Because he's not, he's not killing someone. He's not saying uh, a certain person's name. Like he said, no everyone's gonna be happy. Fifty percent mm-hmm. of people are gonna be upset about mm-hmm. it. Fifty percent of people are gonna be mm-hmm. laugh, laughing, and smiling about it. Like. Yeah, but for me, I love this kind of stuff. I love it. <laughs> There's a reason I started with a warning. <laughs> <laughs> if anything, finding out that Jimmy Savile was a paedophile made it even worse that he never answered my letter. <laughs> all of my favourite 70s kids TV stars, they've all been done for it now, haven't they? Jimmy Savile, Rolf Harris, Stuart Hall. I bet Finger Mouse is shitting himself. <laughs> <laughs> did somebody say, when I said my favourite 70s kids TV star, did somebody say you? As if like... <laughs> <laughs> That is fucked up if I'm now in the U-Tree camp. It's particularly fucked up because I was born in 1973. I was a fucking toddler to have been... <laughs> oh, seriously, I was such an ugly child, I had to give paedophiles sweets. It was hard, you know. <laughs> cost me a fortune in sherbet dibdabs just to feel some affection. So... Oh, I've gone bleaker than I fucking intended, okay? All right. Well, we're going to get worse. Pedophile goes into a florist. I'd like some flowers, please. Orchids? No, just the flowers. (laughs) (laughs) My granddad went down in history and on one occasion fingered a girl in geography. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, there's another page. Fuck. (laughs) The great thing about jokes about kids with leukaemia is they never get old. This is going to get me record numbers of complaints. This is going to be fucking beautiful. <laughs> I love magicians. Who was that guy in America made those landmarks disappear? Oh, Bin Laden. <laughs> I think dolphins invented cancer just so they'd have people to swim with. <laughs> Old ladies aren't nosy. The real reason they poke their heads through the curtains all the time is they're practising for being cremated. (laughs) This is good. I've revolted even you. This is wonderful. (laughs) I was in the town centre earlier and I saw people collecting for Parkinson's and they were shaking tins, which I thought was a bit insensitive. Because people collect money for anything nowadays, call it a charity. Recently I saw this woman collecting for reconstructive vaginal surgery following the birth of her eight children. There she was outside Tesco's, waving her bucket. (laughs) 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 Gentlemen, if you think your partner's got a rather large vagina, it's important you never let on to that fact. And believe me, I know, as I once put my foot in it. I think someone's just left being revolted. You're quite right, too, Adam. You're the only decent person in this room. <laughs> I joined a fisting club, not something particularly into. I'm just trying to widen the circle of my friends. <laughs> All right. And these are the most fucking complained about and the ones I said I'd never do on stage again, and I am, seemingly. <laughs> my girlfriend and I were on a touring holiday recently, and we were driving over the Downs, which will teach me to take a shortcut through a special school. The <laughs> <laughs> Downs... Uh, I rang up that new rape advice line but apparently it's just for victims 
I recently went down on my girlfriend without realising she was having her period. As you can imagine, I was very red in the face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gee. Do you know what? What would be very intriguing? Imagine I was doing this with, my, with uh, Dion, my girlfriend. How do you think she would react to this, something like this? Oh, uh, Dion, as a woman, mm -hmm. I don't want to say all women are yeah. the same, but because I know Dion personally, mm -hmm. I don't think Dion would find this funny. Yeah, I feel like. Dion would just be sitting here, like, you know, like, okay, just yeah. giving us some dirty looks. Yeah. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I feel like men are more open to this kind of stuff. <laughs> In general, obviously, we could, we could be wrong. Let us know if you're oh, lazy or watching this. women out there that probably find it funny and be like, mm -hmm. okay, it's just, it's just stand up comedy, mm -hmm. it's not too serious. But the other women that will like, like uh, same as men, like, some, yeah, men some, men like, some men are like, uh, some men are like, uh, should be saying that. <laughs> <laughs> should, should, should be acting out. Karen. <laughs> well, yeah, for me, anyway, I, I love this kind of comedy. Actually, we still got 50 seconds left. Let's go. Jesus. All right. <laughs> I've never seen a complete child porn film, just little snatches. What? 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 I've got one final thing. Um, who wants to see what my sex face looks like? Everybody, great. Okay, just give me two seconds to get ready over here. Hang on, bear with me. Do you know what? So ever since we've been, we've been reacting, I haven't seen you laugh this much. You really enjoyed this one, did you? Yeah, that's right. I feel like, yeah. This guy, legend. It's like back to back, back to back. They're crude. They're Isn't it? And it's the delivery as well. Because yeah. like, he knows when to stop, when to start again. Which is so good, man. Yeah, let us know if it's another comedian wants to check out any more guy to learn stuff. Please comment down below. It's good getting you on board and seeing you like it, seeing you laugh. It's really good. Like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you very soon. Bye bye.